meiosis 1 or heterotypic division or reproductional division. Karyokinesis 1. It is completed in four phases. In this, the chromosome number is reduced to half. Cytokinesis may take place immediately or it may be delayed till the completion of telophase 2. Prophase 1. Prophase of the first meiotic division is longer and complex. Based on the chromosomal behavior, it has been subdivided into five phases. A. Leptotin or leptonema. The nucleus and nucleolus enlarges in size. The chromosomes are long and slender. B. Zygotin or zygonema. It is characterized by pairing of homologous chromosomes and this process of association is called synapsis. The pairs of homologous chromosomes are called bivalence. The pairing is brought about in a zipper-like fashion due to a protein called synaptonymal complex and may start at centromere or chromosome ends or at any other position. Based on the specific locations from which synapses occur, it is further classified into three types. 1. Proterminal synapses. Pairing starts at the polarized ends and progresses gradually towards the other extremity. 2. Presentic synapses. Pairing starts at the centromere and proceeds towards the ends of the chromosomes. 3. Random or intermediate synapses. Pairing of chromosomes occurs simultaneously at various places, randomly, along the length of the chromosomes. Zygotin is also characterized by the enlargement of nucleus and intimation of spindle formation. Pacatine or pecanema or genetic recombination stage. It is a long-lasting stage, weeks or years. The chromosomes divides into two chromatids, thus in each bivalent. Four chromatids are seen. They are called pacatin tetrads. In a bivalent, the chromatids of the same chromosome are called sister chromatids and those of two different chromosomes as non-sister chromatids. The non-sister chromatids exchange their parts mutually at one, two, or many places. Such points where chromatids physically contact each other are called chiasmata. During the formation of chiasmata, the chromatid arms first break due to the action of an enzyme called endonuclease. The broken chromatid arms mutually exchange with each other and get united by the action of an enzyme called ligase. The formation of chiasmata lead to exchange of genetic material and result in recombination of genetic characters. This phenomenon is known as crossing over. It is responsible for the origin of new species and thus leads to evolution.